सर सर एक्चुअली मैं अपने लाइफ से सर फ्रस्ट्रेट हो गया हूँ सर मैं अभी जॉब कर रहा हूँ बैंक में उसके पहले मैं सर सीए करता था ठीक है तो सीए में फर्स्ट स्टेम सेकेंड अटेम दिया क्लियर नहीं हो पाया ठीक है तो समझ में नहीं आ रहा था कि लाइफ में अब दो तीन साल इन्वेस्ट कर दिए आगे अब क्या करें समझ में नहीं आ रहा था देन आई स्टार्ट वर्किंग इन बैंक आफ्टर डेट आई कुड कॉन्सेंट्रेट उन माई स्टडी सो हाउ कैन आई बैलेंस माई वर्किंग लाइफ विथ माई स्टडी I was just uh, talking to a group of people who were studying for UPSC and uh, you know some of those students came and told me for since 4 years I'm trying for UPSC to become IAS I'm not passing but this thought is also not going away and I'm not able to do anything else also this country has facility to admit few bureaucrats some number of chartered accountants some seats in iit some seats in prestigious medical colleges if the whole student community of india feels that only if i get all of these seats then i will be happy otherwise i'll be miserable the country will be filled with moros youth who are not inspired to do anything and that will be the greatest loss so therefore which is greater the number of prestigious seats available or the number of students in the community so the number of students so naturally you are looking at a scenario where majority will not be able to actually fulfill the dreams which are created due to media due to other kinds of social scenarios so this is the situation where all the more you need organizations like iscon to help youth cope with the situation because they cannot manipulate circumstances the only choice and hope they have is how they can stimulate their consciousness to remain completely absorbed and inspired in life